Welcome back everybody, it's Proxy, we're on the Castaway server, and I promise today will be the last day with the stables for just a little while. <laughs> That's right guys, I've decided that like, we've been spending a lot of time, I think the last four, no, three or four episodes have been, in quotations, horsing around. So I thought, you know what, maybe the next few episodes we will start working on some other stuff around our area, but today I want to talk about our pathways. So. If you guys don't remember, last episode I asked you guys for advice on what I should do for the pathway on our builds. And people submitted um, suggestions via Twitter and Reddit. Someone even did a video, which was freaking amazing. And a bunch of stuff. And so I've decided on the one that I like the most. And let me tell you, this was hard. There was oops, lag for some reason. There was a lot, guys, a lot of amazing entries. I think there was about seven people who gave ideas, if I'm not mistaken. And guys, they were so hard to pick from. They were really, really, really good. There was, hmm, I think three for sure that were my favorite. <laughs> so yeah, there were definitely three for sure that were my favorite. Um, let me go get the names really quickly because I, I don't forget them. I just want to make sure I'm pronouncing them right. Okay, so I think third runner up would be, um, I don't know how to say their Reddit username, but they called, and their YouTube name, they called themselves Kuro. I think it might be Asian something like that, a Asian or Ashen, something like that. But um, he did a really, really beautiful canopy design that I really liked. However, because I plan to keep trees around, I think it might be too much leaves. Now, I did really like the ground design, but there was some that I liked more. So the one that I liked after that would have to be Joel Z Bubs. So he did one that looked like it's from the Godzilla Craft server. It was really beautiful. It had a combination of stone, cracked stone, mossy stone, cobblestone, stairs, and then it had an outline of brick. I think it was brick, yeah. Now, I really like this one, but the only, again, the only thing I didn't like was the brick. And I know I could have changed it up, but I kind of want to maybe keep it a little more neutral, which is the... Th I totally just had a brain fart. <laughs> I want to keep it more natural is what I wanted to say. And the person who kind of designed that the best would be Lefty MU. And his pathway, oh, or her, I think it's a he, but I could be wrong. He sent me, um, I'll say they, <laughs> Lefty sent me four pictures, some with bricks, some with stone, some with just wood and stuff. And the one that I liked the most that had, or that was my favorite, had to be one that the third one in the Imdr link. I'm going to actually post the Imdr link down in the description for you guys to see the ones that he sent and the other ones that were actually sent in the um, third place and second place one. He used Ponzel, coarse dirt, and um, dark oak, and then I think it was like spruce. I think it was spruce. Yeah. And it was so beautiful. Oh my god, guys. Now the only thing is, is we don't actually have any, uh, what is it called? Podzol. We don't actually have Podzol right now, which is a bit of a bummer because it looked so good. But what we'll have to do is, I think maybe, maybe grab some dirt and just... I guess maybe do the diamond shovel thing, like the pew pew path block, until we get, uh, 
the proper block to go in there. Ugh, I only have three left. Darn it! Okay, is there something else I can... I'll just put grass there and let that grow in and fix that up when we need to. But I do need to go collect some spruce, guys. Some spruce logs? Do we even have spruce on our island? Yes, we do. Terrace has some over here by his place. I'm gonna sleep, go collect that, and we will be right back. Okay, I'm back. I got the stuff that we needed, and we're actually gonna plant a few of these bad boys just over here, just in case. Well, not just in case. We are definitely going to need more of this. So we're gonna plant these just along here to get some growing for when we finally need to collect some more. We'll do that, and a last one right there. All right, so since we don't have Podzol, I am gonna have to take that into consideration and I guess just try my best at making this look good without the Podzol for now. And I need this wood. Did I make all that in, darn it. Oh no, okay, I was like, did I make all that into stairs, really? But I didn't. So the spruce wood, and then we would have the podzole inside here as well, which, guys, it looked so cool. I was, yeah, very, very happy with it, to say the least. Pleasantly surprised? <laughs> but yeah, this is definitely my favorite one out of all the suggestions that had been given. Um, for many reasons, like, I did want some form of a border around here, but I think now that I see it, it actually does look really nice without the border. And I might have been just trying too hard, and that's why I couldn't figure it out myself. But I'm glad I did have you guys help because it has uh, made a huge difference, and I think it's going to make this look so much better. And it's kind of cool just to have you guys help out every once in a while. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? God, I really wish I had the podzol. For now, I guess I'm just going to have to put regular dirt in and let the grass just grow throughout, and then we will... When we get Podzol, we'll do that, and maybe we'll just use the pathing blocks for now. I know it won't look 100% nice, but, uh, you know, you gotta, you gotta do what you gotta do, I suppose. I suppose, huh. Uh, we're gonna put another, actually, over there. Put the dirt back here, put another one of these here. I just have to remember the lining that I want <laughs> for, oh. I don't like you like that. You have to turn? Ugh, ugh, okay, whatever, you're fine. You're fine. Um, darn it, I really, I really wish I had Podzol now. We need something, I need, maybe I'll put some stone or something there to, to, to make do. Let's just put some polished, no, we'll put the cracked brick, I think, or the, regular brick there. We'll just throw it there. I I can't use the grass. It doesn't look right. Um, this is probably going to look really dumb as well. So we'll just have to wait and see. Anywhere that was grass. If you guys hear background noise, oh, that's one thing I wanted to talk to you guys about. So uh, today is Sunday, September the 6th. So I am going back out to school tomorrow, which is Monday. Now before I leave, I do want to record a few videos for you guys so that my channel isn't super empty for next week because I don't think I'm going to record anything next week. I'm going to leave next week kind of open. Um, or I want to leave it open for myself so that I don't have to be too worried Jesus. So I don't have to be too worried about stuff. Meaning that the videos you're going to be getting are ones I have pre-recorded and they're going to be recorded from just stuff that I've done this week. I know the stone looks like poop, guys. Oh my god, I'm so sad. I wish I had Podzol. <laughs> Whatever. So yeah, stuff I wanted to talk about was we are leaving tomorrow and I want to give myself the chance to not have to record all week. Meaning that, like I said, videos are only going to be from stuff that I've done this weekend and last week. So um, it's not going to be too much. I think we'll have this video on Monday. Then we're going to have on 
Wednesday an ARC video and Thursday is going to be another CTP video. So it's just going to be kind of uh, the normal, I guess, like maybe three videos a week type thing. Hopefully that'll be enough. I might try to squeeze in next weekend uh, or during the week have something for maybe Saturday and then I can start my recordings back up again on Monday just so that, you know, it's not... I just, I just don't want to leave you guys hanging, okay? I just, I don't want to leave you hanging. <laughs> oh, we need to actually let some of the grass spread first. But that's pretty much my plans is to do that. Because I, I just, I need the time, guys. I need the time to be able to relax at school and be able to, I don't know, like... Take, take a few days to get settled in. It's going to take me a little while to get my computer settled in and all that stuff. So I just... And a new roommate. Um, my housing this year got a little... Not a little messed up. A lot messed up. So my friends and I had been planning to get a chalet together. And if you don't know what a chalet is, is for my school, we have... Um, apartments for students so students who are usually the older students are the ones who have this privilege it's usually not first years or second years but it can be if a student um, who's old enough or not old enough but if you want you can get into one of these chalets and what they are is just an apartment that you and four other students live together in so you have like your kitchen two bathrooms like it's a bathroom and a half and stuff like that and you share that between each other which is nice like it really is a nice layout that they've been able to provide to the students because if it hadn't been like that it, ugh, I anyways what I'm trying to get at is we had planned to stay in one of these chalets and that would have been myself Zach so for those of you who don't know Zach is my boyfriend um, my good friend from my art program and his friend and we were gonna stay in this co-ed chalet together to I don't know just make it nice on ourselves like we're fourth year third year students first Zach is a first year but he because he's old enough he got lucky and he's able to get in a chalet um, but uh, you know God I'm this is, it's really hard to talk and freaking build at the same time guys forgive me <laughs> so we all applied to live in this chalet together and obviously you have to do like a down payment and stuff so that they know you're actually going to pay for your housing now the only thing is is one of the girls that we were with her down deposit didn't actually go through wah 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 meaning because she was the only one who didn't get her payment through, we all got penalized. Penalized? 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 I don't know. Whatever. And none of us, well, we couldn't get the co-ed chalet. So Zach and Daniel are in a chalet together with two international students who I think may be Korean. I'm not 100% sure, but by their names, it looks like they could be Korean. And I am sadly by myself. Um, in a chalet away from theirs um, with three international students who could be Korean as well. I'm not 100% sure. We do get a lot of Korean um, exchange students, but we do also get students from Japan, uh, Nigeria, like um, Taiwan. Like we get them from everywhere. It's really amazing to see. And so I don't mind living with them and stuff because like I'm sure you guys can tell I'm very open and super loving and I could pretty much become best friends with anyone guys like just <laughs> that's it's just the way it is and the only thing is is it just kind of sucks like when it comes to recording so everyone that we had signed up for the chalet with so Daniel and Caitlin and myself and Zach they all knew I recorded and it was like a cool thing to them. They were like, oh sweet, you record videos, like you're so badass and stuff, like that's so cool. And it's like, good, good, like 
Good. I don't have to worry about you guys thinking I'm some weird freak for recording YouTube videos. But now that the Korean, I'm going to be living with the Korean students, I'm just a little bit worried that they'll think I'm a really big introvert and weird because I'm like in my room all the time, like talking to myself. But in fact, I'm actually talking to you guys. So it has me a little, little tiny bit worried, but it should be fine. I'm hoping it'll be fine. Cross my fingers, it'll be fine. But, you know, we'll get it. It'll work out, I'm sure. I'm sure they won't think I'm too crazy. And if they do, um, I'll just cry myself to sleep every night. It's fine. <laughs> Not really. I'm sure I'm, yeah. I think I'm just thinking about it too much. I'm sure it'll be fine. But I'm really excited to leave. And because of all the moving and changing of my program and stuff, it's going to be a little busy the first week. I'm going to have to find where all my classes are again and all that jazz. So it's gonna be an experience I guess and even just getting to know my roommates a little bit so that they don't think I'm freaking weird <laughs> for always being by myself but uh yeah it should be fun and then I think once we figure out schedules and I'm gonna have to figure out my own schedule around Zach's schedule and gym time schedules and stuff like there's just a lot of stuff we're gonna be doing this year um I think we will probably start doing some more live streams again soon which I know a lot of you guys really, really freaking enjoy. And I, heck, I enjoy the heck out of, heck, I enjoy the hell out of them too. I love streaming for you guys. But again, that's all dependent on how school goes and how the international students like me and whatnot. And just, you know, it's, it's, it's going to be a work in progress, guys. A freaking work in progress. So I want to taper our path to be a little bit smaller now. So it's pretty wide here, but that's to line up with this. And I'm tapering it off now so that we can have it maybe a three by three or, yeah, to match down there, which is what the rest of our houses are going to be. We're going to work on this for another little tiny while, and then I think that'll be, like, the end of the episode. Like, it's going to be, like, a talky and buildy type episode today, just so that we can, you know, get you guys on the same page as me and no one feels left out and whatnot. Because that is not how I want this to go, people. I want you in on everything. Well, not everything. Most things. <laughs> Everything would be a little weird. Not not weird. Everything would be a little invasive, I think. Maybe? Do you guys think so? <laughs> oh, I'm so foolish. I don't know. I don't know how you guys can watch me sometimes, I wonder. Maybe you are the crazy ones, guys. Maybe you're the crazy ones and I'm just like, what's going on? I need this grass to spread, dang it. I'm probably going to have to mine a bunch of grass and spread it myself. So another thing I wanted to talk to you guys about is our castaway episodes and even just your guys' support in general. It's been insane, guys. I don't think you realize how crazy supportive you guys have been. Like, all of us castaways have kind of been like, what's what's happening? What, what are this? Like, when why why is there so much support well we know we're amazing of course that's why there's so much support from you guys but it's my most viewed video series i think so far other than when i was doing some daisy stuff which daisy will return definitely i just i just need to get in the groove of it again oh i really hope you guys don't hear the stuff that's going in the background uh i'm really nervous to listen back to this recording but so I'm starting to make my way down, and I really am liking how this is going, guys. I added a little bit more thickness here and thinned it off as we went down, just to kind of make it a little more natural looking, I guess. Uh, that one, oh, no. Uh, no. No. Oh my god, what am I even doing? What am I even doing? What is this life, guys? Um, let's actually put a stair here instead, maybe? Uh, this is so hard sometimes, like, just trying to get everything looking a little even and nice, I guess. Best way to say it. <laughs> we'll have some more of those grass plots here. It's getting nighttime freaking again, man. It's always night. But 
Yeah, so I just got actually a message from Daniel saying he met the, uh, met Zach's and his new roommates, which are the Korean students, and he said they got in at like 3 o'clock this morning, but they're super nice, which is a good thing. That was dark, I'd stop recording for a little bit, um, was going to get something, but, oh, dark left, whoa, that was like, I was just sitting in that bed, not even expecting anything, and then bam, we just, he just knew, it was, it was pure genius, he just knew, <laughs> he knew I wanted to go sleepies, um, what? We'll have grass like that, and then we'll have another one of these, maybe one there. We need the axe. We definitely need the axe in our hot bar. We have so much stuff. I wish we just had like one extra slot, although I could put the axe in. No, I couldn't. I don't know how I would get that to work. <laughs> um, What do we want? We'll have another, maybe a Stair like that, and oh my god, they're yelling downstairs. Alright guys, I'm probably going to call this episode here. I talked to you guys about a bit of stuff, and I hope you guys don't mind. Um, oh my god, this is already looking good, and we don't even have Podzol. What do you guys think? Do you like this? And thank you so much to the people who actually submitted Dizine? <laughs> what the heck? Who actually submitted design ideas. I loved everyone's and I did look at everyone's. Don't you worry. However, I could only pick the ones that I really, really, really liked and or wanted to use. And that's what I did. So, um, I'll, uh... Put those down in the description so you guys can see what I'm basing my stuff off of. But I think this is going to look good. I'll continue this stuff off camera just so that uh, we don't have another episode like this. But next episode, we may work on a super secret project. Or we'll probably keep working on these guys. It depends on if I get uh, the supplies for a super secret project. But good things are coming good things are coming either way. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will try to get another episode recorded for you guys, say, oh, let's hide that stuff. I'll try to get, an, get another episode recorded for you guys, say, by either like Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. I'll try to get something out the weekend so that you could have two Castaways episode this week instead of just one, but there will be ARC, so we'll have Castaways. This episode is going to be Monday as I'm driving out to school. Arc will be Wednesday, and then, what did, oh yeah, and then there's going to be CTP, C, CTP, CTP play waking up on Thursday, and then I'll try to have something else ready for you guys, but we'll see, it depends on time and how I am settled away at school, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you don't mind this really derpy episode, and I'll see you guys in the next one.